Your college experience has begun. You've moved into your residence hall, found your way around campus, and have started making friends. You haven't taken your first class yet, but you're already a part of our community. You're here at orientation, learning what it means to be a member of the Lehigh family, academically, socially, personally. Lehigh University is a unique community with specific values. We're proud of who we are and what we stand for. We're a strong community. We're Lehigh strong. In the next few moments, you'll hear the orientation staff present some ideas about what you can do to make the most of your experience here at Lehigh. We believe that we're a part of a family here, a strong family, a Lehigh strong family. But as is true with every family, not everything is perfect. We don't always make the best decisions, and sometimes we do things that hurt each other or our school. We believe you can make Lehigh the best it has ever been. We believe you can achieve greatness. We believe you can keep Lehigh strong. But to do that, we have to make good decisions, take care of one another, set high goals, take responsibility for our future, and learn from our past. The presentation you are about to see takes a realistic look at college life and some of the situations in which you will find yourselves. It looks at some of the mistakes people have made in the past. It doesn't sugarcoat life on campus, but instead it gives, your cho gives you choices and resources to help you be your best. Some of the language isn't pretty. In fact, some of the language is offensive. Some of the situations are hard to listen to, and some are frightening and enraging. But we believe in our community. We believe in our ability to, ex to achieve extraordinary things. In the end, addressing these issues in language will make us stronger and better equipped to become our best selves. It will make us Lehigh strong. College is a place you become the person you'll be for the rest of your life. Listen to the next presentation with an open mind. Think about what you want your experience and your reputation to be while you're here. Commit to your goals and your future. Strive to be your best. It's time for you to decide who you will be. We are Lehigh University. Lehigh Strong. Strong in spirit, mind, body, and community. We are Lehigh University. Every member of our community has a personal responsibility to acknowledge and practice the principles that make Lehigh strong. We affirm the inherent dignity in all of us, and we maintain an inclusive and equitable community. We, we recognize, recognize and celebrate the richness contributed to our lives by a diverse community. We promote mutual understanding among the members of our community. We, we confront, confront and reject discrimination in all its forms, including that based on age, color, disability, gender identity, genetic information, marital status, national or ethnic origin, political beliefs, race, religion, sex, sexual orientation, socioeconomics, veteran status, or any differences that have been excuses for misunderstanding, dissension, or hatred. We, we affirm. affirm academic freedom within our community and uphold our commitment to the highest standards of respect civility, courtesy, and sensitivity toward every individual. We recognize each person's right to think and speak is dictated by personal belief and to respectfully disagree with or counter another's point of view. We promote open expression of our individuality and our differences within the bounds of university policies. We acknowledge each person's obligation to the community of which we have chosen to be a part. We take pride in building and maintaining a culture that is founded on these principles of unity and respect. Ours is a, it's a tradition of excellence. This, this is Lehigh University, University, and we are Lehigh Strong. These are our values. This is our vision. Our hope. Our dream. But, but we, we have, have to work to attain it. We have the chance. The opportunity. The responsibility. To create a community that is inclusive, welcoming, supportive, and diverse. To create a campus where civility trumps hate and respect overshadows intolerance. It is our responsibility to uphold the values of Lehigh University. Our responsibility. Your responsibility. In the classroom, on the field, in the residence halls and labs. In our clubs and organizations. In our friendships and community. Everywhere. The Lehigh community is our responsibility. And you're a part of it now. This is your campus, your community, your mountaintop, your family. What will your impact be? As a member of the Lehigh community, your words matter. Your actions matter. Your behaviors matter. Your attitudes matter. Your voice matters. Your values matter. You matter.
Even here, where we affirm the inherent dignity in all of us, we don't always remember to be respectful. Will you? We don't always remember we are impacting our campus, our community, and our world. These aren't our proudest moments. Too often our words are spoken with hate. Not love. Fear. Not understanding. Exclusion. Not inclusion. Too often our words are spoken without thinking about the damage that they could do. The, the pain, pain they, they could, could cause. Words. 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 Sticks and stones may break my bones. But words? Words. Words that cause pain. Words that lead to judgment. Words that cause fear. Words that lead to hate. Words that lead to violence. Loneliness. Suicide. Suffering. Crime. Death. War. Words with power. Words that have the power to stunt your confidence. Loser. Words that forge attitudes and actions. Retard. That cause self-doubt. Badass. That paralyze you with fear. Faggot. That sting you to the core of your soul. Bitch. That you never forget. Words. 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 Watch your words. Your words become your actions. Watch your actions. Your actions become your habits. Watch, Watch your, your habits. habits. Your habits become your character. Watch, Watch your, your character. character. Your character becomes your destiny. Who will you be? Even here, where we value academic honesty and integrity by all members of the academic community. We don't always value this opportunity we've been given. We sometimes fail to take advantage of the world-class education at our fingertips. Will you? There's opportunity for an education that so few in the world have access to. Your Lehigh education will change your life. Open your mind. Open, Open doors. doors. Open possibilities for your future. How will you embrace this opportunity to learn? Our faculty are experts in their field. Dedicated teachers and scholars. They deserve our attention, our, our participation, participation, our respect. We deserve to give our best effort. To learn. To think. To grow. To, to be, be challenged. challenged. And on a basic level, there are things that we can do to create an environment where everyone can give their best, be their best. These things seem small, but they make a big difference. Being a student is your full-time job right now. Treat it that way. Go to class. You're here to get an education. That should be your first priority. The easiest thing you can do to be successful academically is to go to class. And be on time. It's hard to learn the information when you're missing half the class. And stay awake. Don't wear your pajamas. Take a shower. Do the work. Come prepared for class. Keeping up with your work is so much easier when you do the work every day. Your work begins when the class is dismissed. Earn the grade. Professors don't give you a grade. You earn the grade by how hard you work and how much time you put into it. And do the work yourself. Don't cheat. Don't use someone else's paper. Academic dishonesty goes against everything we stand for. Put your phone away for an hour. Just an hour. You're here to learn. Twitter, Facebook, and your text messages will all be there when class is over. Seriously, it's incredibly rude to have your phone out during class. And you're not fooling anyone. Your professor sees you. Ask for help. Your faculty wants you to succeed. Visit them during office hours. Ask questions when you're confused. Use the Center for Academic Success. Your Lehigh classes will challenge you. All of you. We all need help to succeed. And don't wait until the night before an exam to ask for that help. Treat your professors with respect. Call them doctor or professor. They've earned it. Look at each assignment as more than a grade. Look at it as a chance to learn, a chance to push yourself, a chance to succeed. Look at each professor as more than the person standing at the front of the classroom. Look at them as a mentor and an expert. Don't waste this opportunity. Make the most of every class, every conversation, every opportunity. Strive every day to be your best. Being your best doesn't just apply to academics. College is much more than just what you learn in the classroom. Every situation gives you the chance to define who you are and what you stand for. College is about growth. And, and change. And, and challenge. challenge. And it's about taking responsibility for your actions. All, All your actions. actions. It's about understanding that every decision has a consequence. Every, Every decision. decision.
He left his door unlocked. Now I've got the new iPad. And a criminal record. I probably won't graduate. It was stupid. I knew better than to leave in my, my purse in the car where it could be seen. I have a busted window. I have to cancel my credit cards, get a new driver's license, and buy a new cell phone. Who will you be? My roommate took the same class last year, so I turned in her old paper. I didn't have time to write a new one. I didn't think I'd get caught. Now I've got an F, a meeting with the dean, and I lost my scholarship. I didn't do any of the reading all semester. Now there's no way I'll catch up in time for the final. I shouldn't have gone out so much. I'm gonna have to take this class over. Who will you be? I remember thinking how beautiful the campus was when I first came to visit. But on Sunday mornings, the remnants of last night's parties overshadow the beauty of our campus. It's our responsibility to pick up after ourselves. I didn't think we'd get caught. We were just goofing off. By now we've been charged with vandalism. It was just a couple broken windows. We didn't mean for it to go that far. Who will you be? Well, my family came to a game, and I realized I was embarrassed for them to sit in the student section. There are drunk people, and the language is nasty. I want them to think that that's what Lehigh is like. I mean, come on, there are little kids at the game, too. I love football. The Lehigh Lafayette rivalry is my favorite part of the year. But we had numerous Patriot League championships in other sports last year. We should pack the stands at every game, for every sport. Our student athletes deserve our support. Who will you be? Those pictures were private. No one was supposed to see them. But my ex-boyfriend sent them to everyone. I'm so embarrassed. Why do we think we can say whatever we want on Twitter or Facebook? I don't even know those girls, but the things they said about me are awful. Who will you be? I didn't know whether to say something or not. All the other guys thought it would be so funny to dress up in blackface and afro wigs and throw a ghetto party for Halloween. Now our fraternity is being investigated and everyone thinks we're racists. I was walking past the rainbow room and my friend made a gay joke. I didn't say anything about it and it's still bothers me. Who will you be? He seemed like a nice guy. She was hot. We were having a great time at the party. I asked her if she wanted to, you know, get out of there, go back to her place. I'd had way too much to drink, and I thought he was so nice to walk me home. She was totally into me. We were just kissing at first, then, I don't know, I didn't want to have sex with him. I told him no. But it happened anyway. We were so drunk. I can't believe this happened. I don't even know what to think. I never want to see him again. Maybe she want to hook up again this weekend. I was raped. Who will you be? All of our actions have consequences. All of our words matter. What will your actions say about you? What will your words be? Even here, where we value diversity, we don't always succeed. Will you? Sometimes our words and actions lead to horrible situations. And unfortunately, it's happening everywhere. On college campuses across the country, incivility is turning to hate. And simple words are leading to violent actions. It's become the background noise of college life. Just something that happens. Just background noise. At Rutgers University in New Jersey, First year, Talek Clementi was secretly filmed having a sexual encounter with another man. The video was streamed over the internet. Three days later, Talek killed himself by jumping off the bridge. He left this message on his Facebook page. Jumping off the George Washington Bridge. Sorry. At DePaul University in Indiana, 23 members of the sorority are asked to leave the chapter. They had done nothing wrong. In fact, the only thing they had in common was that someone decided they were deemed too fat or ugly. At San Francisco State, during a Peace in Israel rally, groups of students cornered several Jewish attendees. Some of them survivors, 
Hitler didn't face a job. I hate your race. I want you all to die. I said that one in her the entire Newspaper staff by your efforts in an April edition that includes racist jokes, sexist by and sexual assault, sexual harassment, and sexual assault, 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 and sexual
I wish someone had spoken up for me when I was called a faggot, badass bitch, retard, redneck. We have the power to decide what kind of community we have here at Lehigh. You can use your influence, your friendships, your voice, your values to, to make, make a, a difference. difference. Will you? Throughout history, it has been the inaction of those who would have acted, the indifference of those who should have known better, the silence of the voice of justice when it mattered most that has made it possible for evil to triumph. Haile Selassie, the last king of Ethiopia. We know better. We are better. We are Lehigh University. And we are strong. Lehigh strong. Strong in mind, body, spirit, and community. We will challenge ourselves. And each other. We will pursue greatness. We will celebrate our differences and learn from one another. We won't always agree, but we will work to be respectful. We will value one another. And we will embrace our Lehigh experience. We'll take advantage of everything that college has to offer. Will you? Your next four years start now. What will you do to embrace this experience? What will you do to create your future? Be a leader. Go to a speaker. Explore the South Side. Audition for a play. Go to a football game. Visit the Zoner Arts Center. Go to a worship service. Attend a musical performance. Join an organization. Attend for six events. Write for the brown and white. Volunteer. Be a mentor. Go to your professor's office hours. Go to the evolution seminars. Seek help before it's too late. Walk. Don't drive. Vote. Vote. Recycle. Be part of Lee Lock Week. Turn off the lights. And lock your doors. Get an internship or co-op. Plan an intramural team. Run the turkey truck. Don't, Don't walk, walk alone, alone at night. night. Don't step in the university seal. Take, Take care, care of one, one another. another. Work out. Meditate. Visit the Center for Academic Success. Attend a career fair. Participate in bed races. Get an on-campus job. Attend a Lehigh After Dark event. Make the right kind of friends. Be yourself. Learn a new skill. Study abroad. Go to the health center. Wash your hands. Watch the news. Go to Sundays. And dance fest. Don't miss the Marching 97 campus tour. Set some goals. Go to make and take. Try out for something. Be a proud member of the Hawk's Nest. Think before you act. Say no when you need to. Check out a book from Linderman and Fairmark Libraries. Get involved. Remember the principles of our equitable community. Wear brown and white. Be Duke. Check. Find a passion. Give, Give back. back. Live your life instead of tweeting your life. Don't spend more time with your Facebook friends than your real friends. Find, Find your voice. Be yourself. This is your time. This is your place. This, this is, is your time. time. This is your place. We are Lehigh. The Mountain Hawks. The Engineers. The Brown and White. We are Lehigh. Mountain Hawks soar together. And, and we are Lehigh. Lehigh strong. And you. 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 You must be the change you wish to see in the world. Mahatma Gandhi. The change on our campus. The change in ourselves. The change begins here. The change begins now. Who will you be? Thank you for listening to Lehigh Life. You should be forming an idea of the impact you want to have on your new community and how it will help shape your next four years. The message you just heard was a powerful yet realistic summary of the positive representation and unfortunate threats to the Lehigh community. If you need additional assistance processing the information you just heard, your orientation leader, your Griffin, and Dean of Students and Student Affairs staff members are always available for follow-up conversations. If you need immediate assistance, you can contact the Advocate on Duty for Issues of Gender Violence at 610-758-4763. Thank you.